Hello everybody, Anthony here from the Hammer Game Channel. Welcome back to my Empire Japan playthrough. When in the last episode we did go ahead and finish mopping up China. It was a longer episode, I think I might have even split into two parts. Uh, we're now over here going to take down the Belgrade Pact, which hopefully won't be too troublesome for us. I think I'm going to try and punch some tanks through here. Well, first things first, actually. We need to call in the Russians. But first things first before that, first things first, is we actually need to move our Air Force over. So, in fact, you know what we'll do? We'll just go ahead and move all of the Air Wings just back into storage. I think that's the best way to go about doing this. Does that mean, oh, actually, does that mean they lose their experience? Because if I've just lost the experience, that's brilliant. Um, 200 planes. Ah, yes, great. Zero experience. That was a great idea. Well done, dude. Well done. Uh, we'll go 800 fighters there. And then, 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 where are the close air support? Hello there. And we are all over eastern Ukraine. Hopefully that's enough to get dominance. Anyways, call the arms. Russia being the plebs that they always are and trying to break through there. Great. To be honest, we might actually be okay at pushing. Just full stop. Oh my days. Okay. Right. It's not great at the same time though. This could be a bit of a grind, but I think once we break them, we break them. Plus, if we can punch the tanks through somewhere... Where are we short support coming? That is the big, big if right now. The big but. Yeah, we could do an instruction. Yeah, this could be a costly ass war, I think. A very costly affair for us. But then they are also going to have a very, very hard time. Yeah, this is this is going to be a bloodbath. It is going to be a bloodbath. That's okay. It's completely fine. We're only on service by requirement, so there is, there is, you know, we do have options available to us. See if we can cut off down here. Now, Germany's doing a military mission to the Cossacks, so I don't know if the Donkovan Union's going to end up joining them. Because if they do, we ain't doing anything. Oh, yes. Gain core. Good. Oh, there's an encirclement of four divisions. Our tanks are doing exactly what we want them to do, and that is driving on through their lines. Oh, oh, an, an ambitious, an ambitious plan here. Right in behind them all. Right in behind them all. It is a very, very ambitious plan. Very ambitious. Could you imagine if it works, though? It, it's very unlikely that it's going to work. But it could. Just like how this tank is potentially doing an encirclement right here. Just think about it, though, if we get in behind these guys, that's like the majority of their army right there. Plus, we do have the divisions to filter in to cover it, so, you know. Come on, stop engaging, stop engaging them. Yes! Get in there. There's eight divisions in there. What we got there? Oh, that was only a couple of divisions. But th this, this cutoff is, this is on the cards right now. Costly, costly, costly. Got a little bit of resistance there. That's fine. We'll just drive up around for Kiev. And we can't core Hawaii because we don't own it. We don't really have much else to choose from, really, except from, like, research stuff. Mm, I don't think we're going to be lucky enough to get that encirclement, but we have, we have killed a lot of men. 
not saying that. It's still there. It's There's still potential. There is a lot of potential here. Oh, we we done it. We we done it. Thirteen divisions in there. That's a lot of guys dying. Ho ho! Holy moly! They've lost a lot of divisions. They've literally lost their army at this point. This has went very very well for us. Can we secure Kiev by any chance? It's a bit of an ask for them, the tanks, to do, achieve that. We are a lot of guns short. We're gonna have to have a recovery period after this, but we are we're gonna win this now. We might actually try and join somewhat of a, you know, another reassurance treaty. Whoa. Whoa, 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 what's, what's this? German proposing a reassurance treaty. Russia, you tell me exactly what that is, mate. Oh no, I feel bad for the Ukrainian divisions in here because they're going to die. We've absolutely destroyed their divisions. Holy hell. I'm glad we don't have to take them out because it's going to help right there for taking out um, the Austrians. Who could be quite troublesome, actually. They do have a lot of divisions. That's how we go for them. I don't know what I really want to do at this point. I definitely want to take out Iran. Just want to see if they can take out Afghanistan first now. Probably take out the Cairo Pact. Then we're kind of limiting ourselves for expansion there. We could strike the Entente once, because I'll have the Cairo Pact. And oh, the Third International does live on. Fanny Jabkovsky. Look at the gold prosperity sphere, man. I'm really hoping you're starting to integrate. Yeah, 1.25 million available to us. Hopefully, they're going to start integrating uh, their um, their territory. Just extend all that. Um, do we really want to get rock artillery? Right, we'll definitely research you. We've got improved anti-tank, which we are still good on. Yeah, we're a lot. Sh we're short on a lot of equipment, like. Might as well just cut the rest off. So that should be the remainder of the divisions. So yeah, just you come up in the round. I continue upgrade our fuel storage because that is what we're needing. So actually, not as costly for us in the end as I thought it would be. Like I thought it was going to be a lot more cost. Costlier for us. Just gonna see if we can actually just cut all these guys off. I oh, might be able to. Well, this tank's definitely gonna achieve it for us. Well, Iron Guard Romania just died, so. Just Serbia to go. Just Serbia to go. And they have four to six divisions. And El Salvador died. We could go rock artillery. What about planes? Still a little bit ahead of time for that. Let's go ahead and grab you. I mean, to do that. Cause I, oh, well, that's the Entente as well. I think we maybe might kill the Entente. We just leave the Germans alone. Unless they come for us. And again, I'd like to take out the Germans as well. I would really like to take them out. They aren't all adults serve. We could get them into an offensive line. Possibly. Like, get them to push on us, possibly. Plus, they're not... I'd say they're not that strong, but they do have a, their allies as well. Keep again, Canada's still fighting the Union of Britain. But the Union of Britain definitely has no way of getting over the Canada. We could do that. Yeah, do you know what? We're going to go for that next. We're going to go for Germany. We're going to leave the Austrians alone. For the time being, anyways. You get the Belgrade. You engage them. 
Now, I'm sure Uruguay is guaranteed by Brazil. Yeah, by Brazil and Paraguay. So, you have just bitten off well more than you can chew, Fanny. Really have. So, the third international is going to die. Oh, gosh. There's still a lot of it. Well, see, it appears that there's lots of divisions. Well, actually, it could be... Oh, no. It can't be Italians. I don't think the Italians have done anything. There goes Costa Rica. Wait, who's taking out Costa Rica? The, the Union of the Union of Britain. What the what the hell? How many troops do you actually have? Thirty to fifty-five. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna just try and punch on through there. Yeah, that tank's gonna get the. Oh, I thought I was doing a drive straight into the capital, but it appear we have a little bit of a nuisance there. What do you think you're doing, pal? You're gonna die. Yep, there we go. That should be Serbia gone. And there's peace. Oh, we're not gonna get Italy though because they didn't do anything. Oh well, sad times for us, but let's go ahead and take all of Romania. More oil. Serbia for, I don't know, maybe aluminum. Gosh, the Japanese influence is well into the Balkans now. Right, so since we're now reached this point, holy crap, that's fleet up a lot of factories, but we're going to lose most of them. Mm. Do I want to give them... Right. Liberate Romania. Fantastic. Liberate Serbia. I don't really want to give it to the Russians because it's going to look stupid. So, yeah, I'm going to liberate the Ukraine for the time being. Just straight back in with that leader. Basically all of them, really. <laughs> so, resource-wise, what we've got ourselves. Oh, chromium's down. Aluminum as well. And a ton of oil, more chromium in the Ukraine. So we do have um, a somewhat decent front with the Germans. If we look at things, we have a little bit of a nuisance in the Pacific to deal with. Africa, we could... Oh, well, no, I can't really be bothered fighting Metal Africa. I was going to say, if we take on Metal Africa, we don't have to worry about the Germans running away to there. We do have a lot of divisions. I do have a lot of divisions. How many factories do we have? 84. Yeah, it's, 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 it's not that many really in comparison to what they have. I reckon we could get them maybe to grind down the rest of their manpower. And I'm sure... What, how strong is your navy? Hmm, okay. That's something I should have been uh, focusing on recently. Do we strike the Entente first, actually? Hmm. Because we could go ahead and try and strike you guys. You're all free, so if I take down one of you, the only issue is neither of those. He need the only one that's got a port is the one that's got the most divisions. Germany or the Entente? The Entente means getting the Canada though. Oh, decisions, decisions, decisions. So you'd even say take down them. The Austrians are actually scraping the barrel. What's the rest of the German faction like? Joe, we need the build. We need time to focus on building up stuff anyway, so... Oh, who do I want to go after? That That's, that's the real question. 3.1k. Because uh, Germany is just so much stronger. 
How we take down the Germans? They have 260 divisions max. What, what are we currently sitting on? What are our allies sitting on? Carlos Spain won. We've got 51, 30, 16, 66, 148, and 39. I feel like we need to attack them. I feel like it's something that kind of needs to be done. You're the Siberian boys, aren't you? You have manpower we can bump. You have manpower we can bump. So what we'll do is we'll go to all of them actually just copy you what's this like that is near enough all right copy that um does ukraine really have manpower Oh, we can do that. With pioneer support, what the, f what the hell? Very posh way of saying stuff. Right. That's the Ukrainian lot finished, ready to go. Just gonna move him to there. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just thinking. I haven't had any time for my troops. Well, it's there now. Probably tons of it short. So it may not be as bad as we think, actually. When I think about it, not military police, not military police. Right, so Russia's got 1.9 mil, so what it is. Can I get a 24 there? Oh yeah, easily. Siberia, I'll leave you alone for the time being. We'll take, how much manpower does Ukraine have? Plenty. Take a 24 of the Ukrainians. Spawn in Moscow. Where's your, ca oh, Pet uh, Leningrad. Oh, and obviously you're going to spawn the Ukraine, so we'll just go with Kiev. Romanian, so much manpower do you have? 1.6. We'll get a whole batch of you guys as well. And then we'll take you and put you under near field marshal. Which we'll go we'll go with him. He's politically connected, but he's level three, so Not terrible. Right. So now that we've got that plan in motion. Uh, we just want one of all those. Then we'll go ahead and make, hopefully, another 16 tanks for ourselves. Just because we kind of need... I think we need some more tanks to be able to bust through the Germans. So we'll go with them. Alright, we do need a, some more civilian factories. Hmm. Oh, you have 101 factories. I should have just annexed you. Oh, that's who I forgot to take the divisions from. Could do that, but I'll wait until I'm actually ready. Favoring too many projects? Well, so I can only go so much until there's a bias. Okay, that is that is fantastic. I guess in the meantime, we'll do, 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 do air production. I can't believe I forgot about my Chinese puppet. What? Oh. I can't conscript your manpower? Well, that is... That is boring. Oh, oh well. I think the best place to position our tanks is, well, not even there. That is a fort line. Probably have to maybe go here and just try and swing them round and cut off the whole of this. Uh -huh. 
I'll set those guys up there. I'll set them up there. So that leaves the tanks to just simply be set up here. We can drive to there. We'll have you guys push into there. You guys into here. Right, that leaves us with you guys. So we're going to have to fortify this up. So we'll probably to put two lots of guys on there. Um, do, 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 do. We have, obviously we have... Oh, the Philippines joined the Reich's Pact as well. well. If we don't call China in, that should be okay. Hmm... Friendship with the French. Hmm. Okay. I hate how the two Sicilies are in half. How are you actually doing? Terrible. <laughs> terrible. We don't even have to look. It's just absolutely terrible. New Zealand's finally died, though. Still means they're, they're, they're the Entente, but oh well. When's this going to be sorted out? 464 days. Okay, we are, we are a long way off of war. We are a long way off, guys. That is insane. Um, I'm trying to think where we can actually naval bombers. Let's let's save those factories for something else, like more guns. Let's match some wars over. We knew this. We knew this. What do you take us for, fools? How many division you got at this point? Quite honest, do we need all those divisions that we're making? What, what are we currently sitting on again? We are sitting on 148 divisions. Produce, you're producing even more, I doubt that. They have eight, 9k apparently planes. Definitely have more than us. We're gonna have to be very ballsy here, like we are playing with fire. They might even see sense. Imagine if we take out the Germans though. You're, you're not... These two are not strong. You've got a decent number of divisions. Germany of course is the one that's carrying the most divisions. So we kind of need to do something before the rest of the guys are able to get more um... Oh, they're guaranteeing the independence of my puppet. And Russia's guaranteeing the independence of them. Well, that's hilarious because, well, they ain't gonna help you. Oh, I guess we could be really scumbaggy. And not call in the Ukraine. South and North Korea have been integrated. We got anything here? How are we doing? In Legation City influence twenty four percent. Yeah, we can't do any of that. Right. Nice seven thousand. Oh, that's finished. Four hundred twenty two days. It's only nineteen forty two. I thought it would be later by now. Well, there's, there's our 16 tank divisions. There's a whole 24. A good option to get some divisions is to push straight through Gommel and get this. Get Gommel's cut off, taken care of very quickly. Wow, we're up to 4.34 million. You'll do it. You're not great either, really. So we'll dump, dump them there. So 
So where are we going to need these other 24? I guess I could use them as... I need some garrison. So one of them is going to be garrison. Can we give you any more promotions than you use? Oh, we can give you something. Charismatic. I guess organization first. Infantry expert all the way. Nothing. Further integration, Taiwan. Great. Everybody needs to exercise as well. Is this Iran Afghanistan war just fizzling out? Because I could still do with getting more oil. I do have 39 oil. I can import all of yours near enough. It should, yeah, it's really going to help us out. We're going to lose all this aluminium with less million. Hungary is here, though. They're hungry for my trade. And we can just continue getting our steel from China. Okay, okay. The Germans are going to show so much force here against us. Just the Cairo Pact, okay. Good, good, good for them. I still can't believe how good that is. <coughs> 396 days till war. Still a long way away. To be honest, I don't think we need these ones. Still makes us 53,000 short. Because all that we really need is a garrison, so you're reckless. You're reckless. You can be field marshal. The Ukrainians can be our garrison. Just because just they could invade us from like the Philippines. I'm not too worried about the islands there. Plus, I can get naval bombers out. They shouldn't really have much of an air presence. Yeah, we'll move them onto a new theater. They're really all that remains in our way. They have a war goal. They, oh, legionary. Oh, gosh. You don't want to do that. That's insane. They have those factories from their own territory. We might be able to get the jump on them with the ultimatum. But we do still have to wait 229 days before we can consider doing anything. We have to consider, just, you know, we have to take some time to sort things out. So what I'll do is I'll probably skip to the point where we can actually do something next episode. Because I'm just going to be sitting around doing nothing, really. So, I'll leave that episode there. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I shall be back very soon for some more. Take care. Cheerio bye. The now.